Yo, what up, guys? It's your boy, son, TJ. How's it going? Today, I'm here to do a fan fiction class or versus matchup between All Might and Endeavor. Now, this this whole ordeal picked up a lot after the Endeavor fight against High Noon in our, our high end, <laughs> high noon, high end in the anime. And a lot of people are commenting saying that they think Endeavor can beat All Might. Now, it's pretty obvious, at least if you're if you're a big fan of My Hero, that you know Prime All Might is the strongest character in My Hero so far. Again, there's characters that can surpass him if you follow the manga. Again, this this um this video is gonna have anime and manga spoilers, so if you don't want those, then you know it's gonna be kind of hard for you to watch this video a little bit. But um, you have characters that could surpass All Might in the future in his prime, but for right now in his prime, he is the strongest character. With the second being All for One, right now. It's been a big debate because for right now, it seems that um, Endeavor has some hacks where he can probably beat All Might. Since in the canon, it's been said that the high end that um, the Nomu that Endeavor fought is a stronger Nomu in terms of just overall evolution than the Nomu that All Might fought. So I want to get a look at pretty much the, the All Might that we've seen so far in the anime and manga, the, the D prime, like the, the, on the All Might on the decline pretty much versus Endeavor and his full, full abilities that he displayed against high end in this fight. So. Um, we, we, we know that even when All Might was on a decline, he was the, considered the strongest hero out of everyone. He was the go-to in terms of who, who, like, if someone needed help, he was the one, right? The biggest thing that he had, though, that he had lack of how long he could stay in his form. And the biggest thing that stopped All Might from beating people pretty easily was that time limit, where even with when he fought All for One, all for one pretty much used bystanders and use his time limit against all um all might and especially since he was on the decline since he gave uh one for all to um deku and even though it was a really close fight i would say if all might wasn't distracted and his time limit wasn't run out he would have been able to beat off of one a lot e a lot a lot more handily than he did before right now Granted, he did struggle against that Nomu where it was perfectly built to face him, right? It was, it had all the, the, the perfect counter to his abilities and it's considered weaker, a weaker Nomu than the highly involved high end. But I still think, uh, you still gotta give it to All Might personally because again, I, it's a close fight though. Like this fight between All Might and Endeavor, it's a lot closer than it was if All Might was in his prime because he's damn near 300 times stronger than he showed um, when he fought that Nomu, especially when he fought um, All For One because well, the biggest thing you can say is that All For One didn't consider Endeavor in um, the ninja hero even a threat when he was waiting for All Might to get back on his feet. He swatted those two heroes like they was nothing, right? And you can say that Endeavor was holding back to protect All Might's pride, which I guess you consider, but you can tell like in story lore, even in All Might at his weakness, was considered the only one who could stop All For One. Now we look at like feats and hacks, right? If Endeavor hits All Might with any of his freaking like prominence burn attacks then hell yeah he can probably kill all might right or like at least where they're heroes they're not supposed to be killing each other unless you're like hawks or someone who's killing heroes but yes endeavor has incredible abilities and incredible durability like he survived high ends like incredible attacks and survived getting his eye pretty much scarred up and yes he's a very powerful hero but he doesn't have the speed of All Might. Like All Might is a guy who looks like Broly but moves at the speed of like 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 the Flash, man. Like he is one of the fastest heroes in this show. Like yes, All Might has not All Might. Endeavor has incredible speed feats where he's able to keep up with characters like Hawks. He's able to keep up with that high end, but the speed feats that All Might has, especially at how weak he was during that time, is incredible. And the amount of punches he can throw out, he will probably he will speed blitz Endeavor. Like if, if Endeavor can be speed blitz by that Nomu, where the point where he didn't see it coming, he will get speed blitz by All Might, right? Now we already know who's the most physically strongest, but yes, if All Might gets caught slipping or gets caught to the point where he's like coughing up blood because his timer's running out, then yes, Endeavor, if he lands uh, like a very powerful attack, then of course he could end All Might. But from the lore perspective, but in the overall abilities, 
I would have to give it to All Might. Like, it's a close fight, though, because of how much All Might has declined and how much of his invulnerability is weakened over the years. But the man, even in, like, his lower end, was able to, like, do almost impossible stuff where even if you read the um, the Rogue um, side manga, he's able to, like, to save, like, a building pretty easily without any casualties whatsoever and considered the number one hero regardless of how his status was but i would do i would say that endeavor is an incredible hero like he he um if anyone else was to take the spot after uh, all might's retirement when he's forced to be that way i would say endeavor could because he has incredible hacks and his abilities are so powerful that he has to be in the sky so he doesn't burn everyone alive but there is a reason why all might was the number one hero regardless of how weak he got because he was just that more powerful than everyone else tell me how you feel in the conversation down below do you think endeavor can beat a weak in all might or do you feel the story it pretty much feats as a nutshell has proven that all might is the stronger hero regardless of how much he's weakened through his speed feats through his overall just power you can you can argue that that um endeavor fought a stronger nomu that that is what the lore is saying pretty much but in terms of like feet speed and just lore all might is always stronger than endeavor because i don't think endeavor is going to get any stronger than where he is now like he is in the maximus prime i will say he's in this prime before he fought um high end because he had two eyeballs but yeah, that's how I feel in the comment section down below. Uh, that's how I feel. Uh, let me know how you feel in the comment section down below. Um, if you guys want more content, please like the video, especially uh, my hero um, content. I'm going to get back reviewing the manga pretty soon. I just got to wait till the next chapter. So, like, you know, the YouTube rates will be going. But I appreciate all you guys. Please like the video. And I think another Drama Fighters video should be coming out pretty soon. Uh, since it seems like you guys enjoyed that. So, yeah. Sun Tijah, peace. Love you all.